How's it going everyone? It's Louis Crypto here. I'm back with another corn update for you guys. Please make sure you like, subscribe, comment and share. It does help grow the channel. In yesterday's update, we were saying for the bulls that want corn to go up, we need to reclaim this $86 wick over here. And I also marked out this level right there, suggesting that we need, uh, while we are still holding this, we've got chances of coming up. We had a little fake out, it went lower reclaimed it and then we had that push up back up into resistance and what we were suggesting yesterday is that we had an ema repel so we were expecting a slingshot motion to the downside which we saw over here it's just that the close did not go below that wick and with this one over here we need to see follow through back test of resistance and continuation lower down to here so all we were doing is basically rejecting this with the wicks going downwards over here and you can see using the Fibonacci's, we were failing to lose the one Fib level with this wick over here. So what's then going to happen is we return to those key levels of retracement, which is the golden pocket between $86.4 and $87. And we're just coming back up into it as resistance. What was once support with this wick is now flipped into resistance. We have the EMA repel. So all that's happening is we've been thrown back under the moving averages, have that slingshot motion, now confirming it as resistance. We can see those two candlestick patterns right over here are rejecting that $86 wick we've been talking about. So this would then suggest that we're attempting to continue this downtrend. Um, Things will change at least in the short term if we go ahead and reclaim 86.6 and $87. And then we'd be looking to come back up to this price. A break of that would send us back to this level over here. But again, as the 200 EMA is there, this is what's technically keeping us bearish, guys. So for the moment now, we've got the bearish candlesticks trying to send us lower. If we fail to break below the one fib level, so if we start to come down but we fail to lose this, then it's going to have one more attempt at breaking through. And if so, uh, we can see that our, the highest that we'd go within this downtrend is about $89. And we were actually able to call that a few days ago uh, with that crazy uh, fake ETF pump over here. And we were suggesting that price was going to come back up to this double top. And that's what, what was the case. So don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share. And I've also got a discount until the end of the month now. My course is now down to £100. It's going to teach you from a complete beginner into a self-sufficient trader. And you're going to be part of my Discord community totally free for the next three months. In that, you're going to get 12 to 24 group mentorship sessions. So in those sessions, we're going to go through a bit more advanced things. Make sure that you're following the criteria provided. And yeah, just making that strategy that I provide a bit more bulletproof so you know exactly what you need to be looking for. And yeah, if that's of interest for you, please find the Twitter link in the description down below and message me on Twitter and I'll give you the discount code so you can apply at the checkout on the website.